Welcome to Ridge Life. I'm Tim, and today on Ramblings, I am out of the house. Woo, guys, I got a shower. I got a little shave. I know the beard is getting a little scruffy. Uh, even got my hat on to keep that sun out of my eyes. Uh, it is a kind of a, well, it was a rainy day all morning here in West Tennessee. Yesterday was the eclipse, right? I know you've seen it all over YouTube. Um, we had partly cloudy skies. I went and done my physical therapy, and uh, my physical therapy appointment was at two o'clock. The total your totality here was 97.5 percent was at two o'clock. So on the way in, I looked up. It had a little thing blinded me a little bit. I got in and um, did my physical therapy. Physical therapy is getting tough, guys. I know you guys are getting tired of hearing me talk about my knee, so I won't go too. Too much deeper into that. Uh, got home yesterday, and whoo, guys, the weather changed. I'm talking storms came up. Um, the wind was so bad, I was worried about blowing over the chickens and the rabbits again. I know I should stake them down. I got. I'm actually going to move them. I told you I'm move them next to the garage and then stake them down. Uh, did not get that done before the knee surgery. Uh, but guys, the wind came and reports of hail just south of here golf ball size so i opened the door came out here on the front porch with the crutches of course and i saw a little pea size hail coming down uh, on the ground i was like oh no guys the f-250 ford went with aluminum body you know that's how they get the fuel mileage and then big trucks now um aluminum body but luckily the pea size hail there wasn't much of it we were fine but what was crazy remember uncle sonny right my grandma carol which is my mom and my uncle sonny uh, he lives uh, about 40 minutes from here and uh, the storm was just south of us heading east northeast and uh, it went right through his uh, house and they had like egg size hail destroyed a ford uh, 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 motor dealership just destroyed it but luckily at his house he was fine in the same town. That's how this small this cell was, but how strong it was. That's how tornadoes are uh, and these type of weather cells uh, here in the, the southeast. Um, it went from there, which was Bolivar, Tennessee. It went from there to Jackson, Tennessee and turned into a tornado and destroyed a bunch of uh, businesses and stuff and roofs. And I don't think anyone was uh, injured or killed, though. You know, I hope not. Uh, I did not hear any reports, but it was bad, bad, bad. But here on the ridge, we just got a lot of wind, a lot of rain, and it was just a, just the cells were just you know a mile or so wide, a couple miles wide, and uh, so luckily we were just north of it. We were fine. Um, it, did my PT, came back home. You know, got through all that. Did my PT. Um, I told you yesterday with the big news about finding. <laughs> the trail cam video of me blowing out my knee. I'm still embarrassed by it, guys. I was talking to my physical therapist about it and saying, I'm so embarrassed when I put this video out. I thought it was gonna be cool looking me jump off the foyer and my knee buckle and I go down and I'm like, oh, you know, because I worked after it. I got up and I finished the video and everything, right? With a blown ACL and I'm a blown meniscus. <sighs> well, it was not that it was not that manly it, it it looked like something out of ren and stimpy or you know beavis and butthead uh, well i shouldn't even say either that because Jin Jim was there and she's ne she's neither beavis nor butthead or ren nor stimpy right uh laurel and hardy and i'm i'm the i'm the i'm the idiot right um abbott and costello and i'm the idiot right so that will be coming out very soon that will probably be out later in this week or maybe the weekend because the trail cam video which well, that'll be part of the trail cam video uh, i said i was going to put the last hunt the last whitetail hunt in that but guys it was it was too big it was too big to, to fit in there it'd just be too much you know me blowing my knee out trail cam video of all those huge deer that are still here on the ridge made it through the deer season uh and then and then the hunt so you're going to get um Wednesday or Thursday? Wednesday or Thursday, you're going to get the last whitetail deer hunt on the ridge. And um, Jen Jen's in it, and it is really, it is really nice. It is a really good video. Uh, I, I, I've watched it twice now. It's, it's a little long, uh, but if you enjoy nature, the sounds of nature, and just seeing beautiful wildlife in their, in their natural habitat, bucks, oh yeah, I'm talking about it. Yeah, yeah, you might not know this story. I bet you don't know this story. I think I kept this a secret. So uh, that'll be out either Wednesday or Thursday. So that'll be uh, the last hunt video. Check that out. And then later on, you'll see the Tim blows out his knee trail cam extravaganza. 
I also promised you the game-changing news for the Ridge. Game-changing. Ooh, baby. I promised you today, and you're going to get it. Okay. So, <sighs> blew my knee out. Kind of slowed me down a little bit, you know, but I've been working in the background getting things done. I got the septic permit. Uh, I've been on the phone and uh, talking to Honest A Blog Homes about my Barnuminium package. We've ironed out uh, a lot of the details. Um, some you don't know. It, the outside of the, uh, of the Barnuminium, I didn't want um, to be high maintenance, right? So the roof is going to be black metal, black metal roof. And I think I'm going with the board and batten, vertical board and batten, about 8 inch, 10 inch in between the battens. Um, going to be a, a snow white or a gray white, right? Black with like a, a, an off white, not an off white. It has to be more of a gray or snow white. Um, board and batten, probably an LP smart siding, right? LP smart siding. It's not concrete. It's not wood. It's not vinyl. I really don't know what it is, but it's, um, it comes in the color you want. And it also is very, very low, low maintenance. Lasts a very, very long time, I think, with the metal roof. And I can use the LP Smart Siding window trim in black. The windows would be aluminum clad wood in black. Uh, the, the fascia, the, the soffit, the eave can be all in LP Smart Siding black or, or the, uh, the, the metal for the roof. You know, uh, there's two different materials there. Uh, the front porch, the big heavy timbers like this going to probably be a smoke stained. You know, it's going to be these big heavy timbers, these four by sixes, six by sixes, uh, heavy timber. The, we're going to have an eight foot by 16 foot front porch, just like this right here, right? Of course, this is way bigger than 16 foot, but it is eight foot wide. So I have this on the front porch. Sorry about the wind there, guys, if you get any wind noise. Um, so um, inside, okay, Grandma Carol's log home is what's called a Genesis log, okay? It's 12 inch by 6 inches thick, and it has the you know, chinking on the outside, and inside she has the Genesis without the chinking, okay? And at the top, right, where the, the shed dormers are and everything, that's actually not solid wood. It's only solid wood on the first floor. Up there it is Genesis siding, okay? 12 inch wide, has the, the little 1 inch uh, the groove in the middle for where you'd put the chinking. I'm gonna do on all the interior walls that have an exterior facing wall, I'm gonna do vertical Genesis log siding. Vertical, no, no chinking, vertical. So it gives you that, that outside barn look on the inside. So that's all the, all like, you know, in the great room, the big, big 20 foot tall walls, vertical, those are 12 inch wide. And then, and then on the, you know, like, you know, the kitchen, the, you know, the exterior wall, the windows on that, all the other interior walls, right, will be a one by six tongue and groove, okay? Probably that same snow white, gray white. The uh, roof, heavy timbers, those big giant heavy timbers in the roof and the trusses, exposed, you know, heavy timber trusses, smoke, probably smoked, stained. And then the uh, above where you have the, the heavy timbers coming down, you'll have the uh, tongue and groove, one by six tongue and groove, probably the off-white, smoked white, you know. So you're picturing, and on the in the kitchen and the bathrooms and all that, the ceiling will have the big heavy timbers with also the, the one inch tongue and groove, one by six tongue and groove. So that's the inside. We you know, we've worked out a lot of this where the windows are, the doors and all that stuff. So a lot of that's been going on. That's not the big game changing news, those guys. That's not it. That's not it. For those of you who are stuck around this long to hear the game changing news, the whole thing with my barn dominium build up on the ridge was to be off grid. It's 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 you know, it's a quarter mile, eighth of mile, or half a mile. It's a half a mile um, drive probably uh eighth of a mile as the crow as the drone flies right on the top of the ridge but you know to drive there in the Kubota or whatever it's it's a half a mile um that's a long way to get power right it was gonna cost you know eighteen thousand dollars probably to get power or something like, i don't know something like that it's uh i forgot how much eight hundred dollars a transformer eight hundred dollars um uh Eight hundred dollars for a transformer, eight hundred dollars per telephone pole, plus other stuff, you know. So they don't give you any leeway here. No leeway. You don't get the first, you know, three poles for free or any of that here. So I wanted to go off grid, okay? And uh, I determined on what, what kind of uh, 
inverters I wanted, what kind of uh, batteries I wanted, EG4, really, really good stuff. Um, go with the bifacial panels, solar panels. Um, the EG4 LL uh, batteries, very smart, smart batteries. Uh, the EG4 uh, XP um, 6000 uh, inverter, um, they're all in ones, all in ones, right? S split phase, get the 220 out of it. Uh, stack those together, you know, just, 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 that, I got it all figured out. Been, been working on this for a while. So I had to pick who I was going to buy it from. And there's a lot of solar suppliers in the U.S. One of the best, I think, is out of Texas, Signature Solar. A lot of the big YouTubers have gotten their materials from Signature Solar. Uh, a lot of them promote Signature Solar. They, they sell EG4, they sell uh, Solark, they sell a lot of other brands. They're not a manufacturer, they are a uh, supplier, right? Nero, they're a supplier, right? Come on, Nero. Where are you barking at, buddy? <laughs> always, right? Always. Um, Nero, here's something. That's a big old dog. Now, you, you come up to the ridge, you go, you go, you go, you go, you gonna get, you gonna get scared away, right? So signature solars, who I've determined I wanted to go with. So I, I contacted them and I got a quote. And you know, remember, I'm gonna go in phases. I'm gonna bring the ridge crib up on top of the ridge first, as I'm doing building the barn dominium. Get that up there this summer, right? Um, Nero, you need to hush. Cut it. <laughs> um, so I need to get some solar panels, a solar house, get some solar inverter and all that so I can bring the ridge crib up there, have the well and the septic, you know, I just had the septic permit, you know. Um, so I was gonna do the solar in phases. That first phase, I got a quote, guys, on the first phase of solar was about $16,000, just for that first little phase, not including everything. So let's say 20,000, right? Uh, looking at how, what I would need for solar to uh, provide for the full barn dominium, you know, have that um, Generac generator and the, uh, the, the full 24K solar array and the, you know, the eight, you know, racked batteries and the, the three or four XP 6000 inverter all in ones, you know, probably 30,000 bucks, maybe 40,000 in the end, right? With K copper costs so much and all that. Signature, Signature Solar supplies all that materials, all those materials. So let's say $40,000, okay? So I contacted them and I got the quote, 16,000 just for that little bit, just for that little bit. And David from Come On Homestead, he also uh, contacted a supplier and uh, it was about 16, 20,000 for his also, I think, right? So it's, you know, that, that's in the ballpark. And that, again, his, his was just a small starter also, right? Um, so I got, got real good with the salesman there and told him I'm on YouTube. I got these channels, you know, I'd love to really uh, partner with them to, you know, to showcase, you know, their, 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 their supplies and all that. And told him, you know, I'd buy the initial stuff, I'd video it, and, you know, maybe we could work on something in the future. Well, the salesman uh, uh, said he just got a promotion because uh, he's the one that quoted me, right? 16,000. He got a promotion. He's in a different area. But he said uh, he talked to uh, marketing and uh, they, they like what they see at Ridge Life. Ridge Life ramblings, right? Ridge Life's reviews and how tos. They liked it. Um, they liked, you know, you guys. They liked your subscribers. They see because you know they can see the you know the kind of content people watch on my channel. They I gave them access to my analytics so they could see who watches. You know, not who, not not Jenny and Bob and Susie, right? But uh, what you know the demographics of the people who watch my channel, and they like what they saw. So they said, Tim, would you like to be a signature solar? partner, an affiliate. And I've, I'm affiliates with like Blue Eddie and a couple other things, you know, and you know, it's, it, you know, I, I get a link, you save 15%, I get a little commission, you know, they give me a, you know, the little, they give me a little solar generator, you know, you know, less than a thousand bucks, you know, or maybe a thousand, you know, that, that's nice, that's nice. I like, thank you, Blue Eddie, I love you, Blue Eddie. Signature Solar said, no, Tim, we want you to be a full, you know, um, affiliate partner. We are going to allow you to purchase all your products, all your solar system, all everything you need from cable to connector to frame to battery to solar panel to inverter, everything at 50% off. Did he say 50? I think he said five zero. 50% off. In case y'all uh, need that in fractions, don't do percentages. That is one half 
off. Half. Take it, cut it in half, throw the other half away, and this is what I pay. Okay, so that initial 16,000 becomes 8,000. That initial 20,000 becomes 10,000. The initial 30 becomes 15. The initial 40 becomes $20,000. That's a savings of $20,000. Now you guys know, I've been off work for about two months now because this darned old knee. And I'm probably gonna be off work, you know, till July or August. And my pay has suffered. I'm on that little uh, light, uh, uh, short-term disability, you know, through work and it's, it, it's, it's like half pay, right? Um, so I've been kind of hurting on, on getting the Barnuminium stuff, you know. I, I'd planned on, you know, um, financing a lot of that as I went before I retired. And I can't, I'm barely paying the truck and the Harley payments right now. Uh, you know, other, uh, you know I, I had a plan. I was going to work my tail off at work at the steel mill, get all that good steel mill money, pay off the truck, pay off the Harley, retire, and, and, and also buy the septic and the well and all that with the, the, the work money. And then when I retire, finish out the barn dominion with my 401k money and everything. I had it all planned out. <laughs> your plan? Uh, you, know, you ever check in with God? God says, nope. <laughs> you're, you're, I'm laughing at you. Um, but guys, better things happen. That's $20,000 in savings. That is my well. That is my septic. Game changer. Game changer. So, Signature Solar just bought me a well and a septic system. That's about ten thousand dollars each. One six thousand, one twelve thousand, or fourteen. It's about twenty thousand bucks for a well and a septic here in West Tennessee. Signature Solar just say just bought that for me. Oh my goodness, guys! That is a game changer. If you don't think that's a game changer, you're not watching the right stuff, okay? So, in every one of my videos, you'll see a Signature Solar link, okay? If you go there, uh, I'm also going to get a commission on anything people buy from Signature Solar. They sell it all. They are, the le they are one of the leading suppliers uh, in, in America, for sure, if not the world. I don't know about the world, but in America. Signature Solar out of Texas, a great company. I uh, talked to them, talked to several people there uh, about this. I'm trying to get some hats and some t-shirts so I can do some giveaways and things, because you know, it's pretty sweet, pretty sweet. So, guys... I can't just not share the love, can I? You know, Tim, he's got he's to gotta pay it forward. He's got to be the guy that's nice to the, his friends and family. I said, hey, I got a buddy, old David. Come on, Homestead. I'm supposed to be going over helping him with his solar as soon as this knee gets to the point where I can drive. Want to hook up my good buddy David? He's already got huge subscribers, huge followers that love the off-grid lifestyle. He's already 100% off-grid. And they're like, We'll look into him. I said, well, please do. And I copied David on it. Well, guess what? David from Come On Homestead, he's in the works with Signature Solar also. Guys, this is not a competition. When you get when you get a blessing, share that blessing. It's not going to take anything away from you, right? David blows up on Signature Solar and does all his stuff before me. I love you, buddy. I'm happy for you, right? If, if I do it first, He'll be loving on happy on happy for me. That's that's how brotherships work. That's how the family works. It's a good thing. It's a good thing. So that is a huge, huge news. I mean, just a, just a game changer for me. Just bought me a septic and a, and a, and a well. Build my solar house. David will probably come over and help me do a little of that. I know he will. Get my solar array up. Get the solar house up. Get the signature solar initial phase in. Get the well, get the septic, move the ridge crib up there, get the foundation in. Get the, get the eco panels of Tennessee, uh, SIPs panels delivered. And then maybe, maybe get all that done by the end of this uh, end of this year. And then next spring, let's build us a barn dominium. Now, I have the foundation up there hopefully before the end of the year, right? You're like, Tim, there's channels that... Took two years just to get that point. And you're just a single person. You know, Dave, well, he's gonna have contractors do it all. Well, I might have some contractors do a little bit of it. You know me, you know, I, I am I am a little bit of a gimpy person, a little bougie. Uh, but you're gonna you're gonna see every step of the process, and I'm gonna hopefully be a part of every one of those processes. Okay. And hopefully you're enjoying what you see now, and I know you're gonna be enjoying more of what you see. So make sure you watch Ridge Life, because you're watching Ramblings way more than you watch Ridge Life. I got good stuff over there. The hunting stuff coming out, the me blowing my knee up coming out, come on. The Niagara Falls, the uh, natural bridge, the snowmobiling. Yeah, yeah, I did a little vacationing this year. It was worth it. I needed it. Been a rough year. You yeah, know, been a rough year. Um, but it's going to get better. 
thanks to you. And Signature Solar, too. Appreciate you. Go over to Signature Solar and say, you're, you're looking forward to working with Ridge Life. Okay? I appreciate that. Matter of fact, if you could help me a lot, oh, this would really help me a lot. You could go over to uh, send an email to Eco Panels of Tennessee and Honest A Blog Homes. Send them an email saying, you can't wait to see Ridge Life build his barn dominium with eco panels of tennessee sips and honest abe log home heavy timber framing if you could send those two emails to those guys man you would just oh, i'd just be so blessed i'd be so blessed so grateful thank you very very much <laughs> so guys hopefully you enjoyed today's video going live tonight going live tonight actually actually i think i got more big news to put out this week so you better be watching ramblings too i got i got more big news coming out Ooh, it's all good stuff guys so until next time hope everyone has a blessed blessed day and keep rambling and go ridge life oh yeah <laughs>